about to learn. I'll take it. Go! What's up, everybody? Welcome to the show today. We are in Denver, Colorado. Mars, and what's happening? Tell her about us. Right, we're going to go to Gymshark HQ, meet up with our peeps there. Then we're going to come over here and do 21.3 and 4, and then meet up with Uncle Eric Rosa. Roll the footage. Back to San Francisco. It's been, it's been a good it's month with this guy. Yeah. We gotta go. Oh. Bye, Bye, Where are we at? HQ, baby. Okay. So this is Marissa. She's our contact gym shark. Uh, tell us a little bit about yourself. I'm Marissa Johnson. I get to hang out with these guys all the time. Which yeah. Is cool. Yeah. How yeah. long has the gym shark office been open here in Denver? Three months with COVID, you know slow opening. Mm -hmm. I like the vibe. Very, uh, very clean. So you're doing the workout today? Oh, heck yeah. Okay. I'm so excited. You too, right? You're jumping in. I'm in. All right. Yep. yep. Everybody's open. jumping in. My humility is one of the top 100 things I love about myself. Check out all these plants. They get freshly watered every day. There's 400 of them. That guy is a little dry. Nope, that guy's good. Is a cicada a plant? Oh, that's a bug. It sounds like a plant though. <laughs> oh, 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 we look so good. It was us in the flattering pants? Yeah, the flattering yeah. pants. Oh, wow, look at this. This is the meditation room, so you can get your set okay. on. I would just set up my office in here. Achoo! You might win at bag toss, but it's not Boom! Those days. One game win out. streak shot. A lot of these, a lot of these coming up. I'm assuming. There's a barbell. There we go. We're added to the wall. It's official. It'll never be erased. And if it ever is, well, you no. let me know. Who did you just say Rory McKernan looked like? It's a Ryan Seacrest of CrossFit. Yeah. Oh, yeah. He's really. so handsome. Yeah. Former Abercrombie yeah. model. Yeah. Uh, just a little aged. Fair moments away from finding out what this workout is. Yeah. My prediction is there's two parts. What's your prediction? Do you think it's two parts or two workouts? I think it's two workouts. Last one. Last Excited to do it. Yeah. Two parter. 21.3 is. 15 front squats, 30 toe to bar, 15 thruster. Before continuing on with 15 front squats, 30 chest to bar pull ups, 15 thrusters, and once again, 15 front squats, 30 bar muscle ups, and 50 thrusters. That just so <laughs> gross. Thanks for nothing, Dave. Castro. Okay. So some of the well, I've, all the workouts right. have been good finished. for me. Yeah. So we'll see I what still happens. Need to introduce 21. I feel, I feel like the. Four. I can't tell. Oh, it's, it's coming, it's coming. Ladies and gentlemen, right. 21.4. 21. 21. Complex. Deadlift. Oh, it's a barbell complex. Oh, no. Scuds. Into Scuds. clean. Power clean. Into hang clean. How, shout out to her for doing this at 175 with like zero warm up, probably. Yeah, uh, she probably warmed up. Into jerk. looks so confused. I mean, all I see is a chalkboard with a bunch of arrows and numbers, so. I feel like I got you on the second one. That's a, that's a given. All I've been doing for the last four months is bodybuilding and a little bit of CrossFit and lots of squats and legs. So the thrusters and front squats, I'm excited about. I've also been building my chest, so the chest of our pull-up should be easy. Tell me, did you bring two sets of grips? I don't think I did, buddy. <laughs> uh, okay, so Julian just uh, sent us a message, uh, rolled the footage. Yeah, I don't know if I'm gonna get it on that first part. Probably not, but I should definitely beat you guys. Not Mars, definitely Heaps on that second part. Okay, we're back. Uh, I think Julian has a great shot of beating me on both of those. Yeah, Julian's a mover and a shaker, but I don't, I don't know that, that he's got good by muscle ups. Scott, 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 Scott is moving. moving. He's like, I got old age, but I know what I, I know what I got and what I don't got. Uh, there's a lot to juggle right now. A lot to juggle, yeah. Yeah, so yeah. I'm just kind of figuring out, like, you know, if you had how do I, how I, yeah, if you had a car, how would I take the NOS out of it? Yeah. You know what I'm yeah. Okay. Gotcha. See you there. 
Okay, we just got to Apex. We're here with Austin. You're, this is your gym. Yeah. Workout just got announced. What do you think? It's intense. I'm a little nervous for it. Yeah, um, yeah. I'm pretty good at thrusters and pull-ups. Uh, yeah, I can tell a, by your stature. <laughs> makes me a little bit more nervous about it because you know how bad it's going to hurt. Oh, then. yeah. Take this, Barston. Take that, okay? All right, you fine? You okay? Uh, we've been open for about two years now, so we're expanding this. We just got the confidence to kind of put some money down into the new expansion in addition to the CrossFit stuff, uh, which we actually just reaffiliated with CrossFit. There you go. CrossFit uh, Rhino. Yeah, so the Gymshark crew, you know, they, they figured we're with the Buttery Bros. We might as well try this damn thing. So we're going to try and put them through a scaled version of the workout. I'm not really sure what their abilities are right yeah, now. Yeah, we don't know if they got kipping pull-ups Yeah, pull -ups, but we, oh, we got a PhD, you know. We're ready to yeah. teach them what's up. And, and then... And then, Final week. Let's get it. Yeah. I'm gonna go, go find myself a push one. You know, I'm a pusher. Town. I can't wait. All right, she's about to learn. You're, uh, you ever done any kip swings? Oh yeah, but this is like. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm yeah, a yeah. natural. Yeah, yeah. He's this. got it. Yeah, you got it. Oh, yeah. Hey, good job. That was good. <laughs> We're gonna stretch him out real quick because we're all kind of tight and sitting at the desk all day. So put him in the go wad protocol for this workout. This is called the banded lat stretch. Right, Only we're doing not, not the banded lat stretch. We're just doing a bar lat stretch. All right, so it's about to go down. Just trying to give him a stimulus, trying to give him a little taste. Want him to come back for more. You don't want to crush him the first time, you know? Here's a sip of the Kool Aid. You don't want to give him the fire hose. Cheers. Good, good luck, my good friend. Luck. Yeah. Good luck. Okay, well, all that I just gotta say, all that I want to do is be Christine. Oh, okay. Right? Danielle, Danielle's a savage. She's gonna just, you know, Christine. Okay, I'm gonna keep an eye on the two of you. Here we go. Like a champion. Like I yeah, went that's into that's it. That's right. There's so much intensity, you know, like energy. Yeah. I loved the ring one. Yeah, the, uh -huh. ring, the ring row. 13, almost So first one in the can, what do you, what do you yeah. say? Like, you ready, you ready for more? Or yeah, you, did that scare you away? Did we give you just enough? I just want to watch you guys. Okay, it got it, got it. Did you fall in love or what? Um, Are you I, the Kool-Aid? I fell in lust, maybe. Oh, okay. So there you lust, yeah. It's kind of it's sexy, passionate. but you don't I'm really know. I want to know how to do it. Yeah, that was tough. Yeah. Yeah. That was, you guys were like, oh, yeah, we'll do 95. I was like, Dude, sure somebody made that, that barbell for me. I didn't put that in there. It was tough. Yeah. I could not get the swaying down on the bar. Well, kipping is not something you just learn in a day. Yeah. It was a lot of fun doing it with my teammates. Yeah. The environment was yep. right. The environment was right. The, yes, the motivation. The environment was right. The, the music yeah. was right. Yeah, there you oh, go. The, the right coaches beats. were The coaches, right. yeah. I didn't, I didn't, yeah, I didn't do I'm much coaching, but I'll take it, yeah. yeah. Right. This is the final week of the Open. This is 20.3, 20.4. You better show up. I gotta bring the heat. You better show up. Three, two, one, out Go. the gates. I would say we came out hot. We came out aggressive. We yeah. did the 15 unbroken, no problem. I jumped up on the toes bar and I was like, I'm just gonna see how it feels. I thought you were gonna go and broken on those. What'd you end up doing? I went 20 and 10. I had 21 and nine. Huh. We got off to start the thrusters at the same time and I was like, shoot, Marcy's really close to me. I didn't even care about that. The only thing I noticed is that we finished quite earlier than Austin. And when that happened, I was like, oh no, we messed up. Jump up to do a pull up, rhythm is gone. Yep. Ooh, that was a little discombobulated, yeah, a little slightly dehydrated, a little bit confused. I got over to the thrusters, I'm broken. But, but, but by that time, legs were feeling real gumby. Right? What? Oh my Final round. 15 unbroken front squats. I was fatigued. <laughs> yeah. And they were like, oh, 30 bar muscle ups and no after problem. all this work. I think I was at five when you started, and I heard you get to the top and go, oh. and I go, got him. You did? Yes. Here's the thing is my judge would go like six, seven. I was like, 
Shut up. It's, it's a, it's a loud. Yeah, it's a good. library. Really? So I finished in 1447. I'm broken on my thrusters. I wish I had finished my bar muscle ups and done three thrusters and then waited for you. Time's running out and I'm like, all I want to do at this point is finish my bar muscle ups. Did you? And I get up and I chicken wing the last one and failed. And I was like, how am ha! I going to go this far? How am I going to go this far and get to 29 up? failed? Finish? I failed my last one. You idiot. So I got a one game win streak. Yeah, it was short lived. Cut to. Cut to. I can't see straight. Yeah, I went over and just looked into the sandbags to try and find hope. <laughs> Is it in here? Yeah. Eber sends a waitress to go get us some Swedish fish. Comes back and I put it in my mouth and I was like, I have nothing in here. <laughs> so you load up a whopping body weight of 165. <laughs> Fail it. I saw that and then I saw Austin hit 185. I was like, I got this. So I did 205 out the gate. <laughs> Nailed it, 225. Nailed it. And then at that point I was like, I'm gonna just let the clock run down to the last few mere seconds of this thing. You got 235, right? Ended up getting 235, body weight. That's body weight. <laughs> Uh, hindsight being what it was, we wouldn't have done the same. Yeah, I'd have, I'd have gotten much slower out the gate. I got a one game win streak for about seven minutes. I'll take it. So seeing as uh, you won the first one and I won the second one, I feel like they kind of cancel each other out, but... Should we just go get some pancakes and call it a day? <laughs> yeah, let's go to the spa. I love smoked. That was the hardest workout, open workout ever. For sure. Just kidding. Just kidding, we put it out to sock med. There's two workouts, if we each win one, what do we do? And the overwhelming consensus is we both get punished. Okay, so uh, that that kind of concludes, the, the uh, concludes the open, and uh, it's been a pleasure. Been a pleasure. I'm glad that we could uh, have done this all this together. together. Yeah, and, I've got uh, on. All here right. we go. Let's go. Uh, back, back it up and humiliate. Off to a great start. Shout out to the Butter Gang. What's up, people? All right, workout data provided by you. What's up, people? Workout data provided by Whoop. So, let, me, let me tell you, going into it, I was 62% recovered. I was in the yellow. 53% recovered. But I slept seven what hours was, and 18 minutes. Let me. What's your resting heart rate? Right now or right then? Right then. 66. Yeah, Dang, mine, dude. Mine was 46. I'm fit. Wow, and your HRV is way high. 123, I was at 74. Yeah, and, and you're 62. Yeah. The strain from the workout was a 10.4, max heart rate was 174. I was a 9.3 with a max heart of 163, but this is a fun little get to know you. Uh, I spent 21 minutes at 70 to 80% of your max heart rate. I spent 12 in that window. I felt like a fish that had fallen out of the sea and was flopping around yeah, on, the ocean, on, the the on the ocean. On the ocean or in the sand? Sand. Yeah, that would parking be Parking lot. Yeah. There's a fish in parking lot. <laughs> Uh, shout out to the Butter Gang. Butter Gang. We're gonna shout, we're gonna go over to the Butter Gang and talk about uh, one of the most recovered people this week is April Bohe. Snowboarding, snowboarding, climbing, functional fitness. She's getting some wow, lifestyle. She gets all of this stuff. She's getting it in the gym and out of the gym. You know what I mean? Shout out to April. Phenomenal job this week. Hit us in the DMs. We're going to get you one of these new Buttery Bros bands. Make sure you use code PANCAKES if you haven't already to join the Butter Gang and to also get 15% off of a membership. Yeah. Okay. On to the next thing. Yeah. We're going to go to the spot. <laughs> How are the legs? Not awesome, but you know, I feel like- Like you just stood up from dinner, you were sitting on a I high chair little, like a little kid. Uh, a little wobbly. I did tell you the last time we we spoke that I wasn't gonna do another CrossFit workout until you came back to Denver and I feel differently now. Oh, how do you feel about it? I feel like I wanna do another one. It's I'm working. I'm, 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 yeah, uh, this is goodbye. Hey, goodbye. Marissa, we love the, the Gymshark fam and this has been a, it's yeah. been a great uh, time checking out the office. It's been good. Yeah. So good. Check out their leggings, check out the aspect shorts. That's my favorite. And this is the Veer shirt. Come on. That's what I just found out. 
I'm, I'm in. I, I want to do it again. Yeah, I feel like I can guy. improve. This I feel guy's like I can got improve. a lot of potential. I saw him yeah. stringing together toaster bar, never done them before. So in lust with it. I want it, I want it so bad, yeah. but my heart's not there yet. <laughs> it's like a one night stand. Thing. Yeah, cool. well no, we don't know yet. My quads are a little sore, but ego is more sore. All right, well tomorrow morning we're gonna meet up with the CEO. We're gonna judge him. I want you to get a monocle. Yeah, and a binocular, like, yeah, yeah. like, we're getting close. That looks like a 90 degree angle. Yeah. I don't know if that's depth. You take the bottom, I'll take the top. Okay, sure. yeah. yeah you like, take squat the, down, squat yeah. down. Nope. Yeah, this is how we I can't, I can't, I can't do it. <laughs> uh, hard enough. Okay, see you tomorrow. Okay, it's bad time. You know what that means. It means that I'm going to pet this cat. Hi, buddy. Hi. Yeah, he's my buddy. Call me Willie Beeman. My dream was that I finished. 21.3 and I stood that's over you that's while you were like looking for coins in the couch and I was like this is what dreams are made of <laughs> Okay. What's up, everybody? We're in Vail. We're in Vail. And guess who's on the show? Yeah. The uh, CEO Rosa. himself, Mr. Eric Rosa, cooking us some breakfast right now, huh? We got some breakfast going. We're going to do some blueberry pancakes. He knows the way to our heart. Digs over her hand. Plan for today is five inches of powder has fallen in the last 24 hours. <laughs> so we're going to get it. God, do have to go. That's a good cake. Good cake. Really good. What's that? How do you say so jacked at your age? I don't know, man. Am I so jacked? Well, you're like you're a rip. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, we saw you in the hot tub. I see some vascularity. Come yeah, you know? yeah. What I want to know, Marston, is how, how are your quads feeling? Ready to hurry up. Ready to rumble? Yeah. Ready to go the slopes. A little story about love This is a story about love A little story about love Nice! Yeah! yeah. It's nice to hear some live music, I'll tell you. It's been, it's been a long time. I got some gigs coming up this summer, which I'm really excited about. Mm -hmm. I always say, I don't care how many gigs I have, but I've got one in the future. Life just feels good, no thinking about it. Is that a solo gig, or you got your boy? Um, I'll be I'll be playing with some some other folks, dude. Okay. Full band. We're called the House Cats. The House Cats. Yeah. Is that because you have house cats? You know, it's a little more a little more to it than that. Okay. That's, that's one of the drivers. Yeah. <laughs> it's certainly inspired by Mr. Blue. Yeah. Okay. Got five inches. Like nobody. That's what she's. <laughs> <laughs> yep, 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 Usually Saturdays are a little crowded. Today seems like a nice, beautiful day. There's fresh powder in the trees. I always like trees that look like this. It reminds me of Christmas, even though it's March. All right, so the open's over. What are your overall thoughts on the last three weeks? Ah, oh, been thrilled, man. <laughs> so many, uh, so many changes this year in a obviously a challenging year. Um, great to see our uh, our registrations get back up above the 2020 level. Much softer than yesterday. This is beautiful. Yeah. I'm getting a lot of positive feedback from affiliates and participants on the three week open. Yeah. Three, three weeks, four events. That, I think that was like the perfect I'm a fan. I finished up yesterday and I'm like, this was awesome and I'm ready to not be competing for a while. Yeah, you're not burned out yep. by it either. Yeah. yeah. Didn't eat them. Wow, that's bright. Yeah, it's bright now. Welcome to the real world. Yes. <laughs> I am feeling my quads today, we'll say, in my yeah. ripped up hands and all that. <laughs> Battle so stars. That was, that was really cool. I think uh, I love the open announcements. Like, I haven't watched them this avidly probably in five years or oh, something, really? you know, yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, it's heavy snow. One, two, three, 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 two,
You know, we've got this new thing now with the top 10% going on to the quarterfinals, you which we've never done before. In the quarterfinals? Uh, well, I'm having foot surgery on April 9th. Uh, yeah. oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. My sense yeah, okay. is I am not going to make the top 10%. <laughs> so skiing is all about spreading butter? Dude, 100%. Okay. Spread butter, spread joy. Fluffiness. Look at that fluffiness. Nice, huh? A lot of fluff. You ripped down that. I like that paddle. Woo! Wow! I don't think I've skied that much in a, in a single day ever. This Eric is a is an animal. Yeah, he's a he's seven hours getter. straight. How's that compared to the other ski days this year? You know, that was uh, that was one of the great ones this year. All right, sure. all right, it's good yeah. to hear. Stand by. Dude, Eric, thanks so much, man. That was a it was, was awesome a, to have you guys. Yeah, dude, really appreciate it. Got to check out your digs and bail, get to go skiing. My Sweet, man. some good food, some great hang time. Yeah, that was so fun. Let's uh let's figure out another adventure to do, man. Let's do it, let's do it. I think we need like a summer adventure. Yeah, let's definitely do a summer adventure. All right, I'm Maybe down some with that. Mountain biking. I'm yeah. in. All right. Maybe some I'm trail running, I don't yeah. know, we'll find something. Okay, sweet. Yeah. Let's do it. Solid trip. What's up next? Oh, we're going to Atlanta. We're going to hang out with Maddie Frank. Yeah, we got some future endeavors. And Noah. We get Noah Olson. Yeah. Heard of him? Yeah, he's got, got a great abs. turtle shell. Yeah. But so, uh, future endeavors, we're about to drop uh, some knowledge on all oh, you babe. Oh, yeah, we got big things coming. Yeah. I'm so excited. So stay tuned. Life things. Goodbye.